Hi, Michael Soldano here. Here's the story. Your best friends in the studio recording their epic debut album and the guitar player flakes out. They call you up, they know you know the songs, you can come down and track this thing. Problem is, your car's in the shop and there's nary a ride to be found. So you're taking the bus. We have a solution for you. It's called the Astroverb. This little dynamo is the smallest, lightest amp that we make, but it has all the big Soldano sound. At 16 watts and 41 pounds, this thing is as versatile in the studio as it is rocking in a live venue. Whether it be blues, rock, country, surf, grunge, punk, you name it, this amp can do it. Let's take a closer look at what this little puppy can do. Okay, so I wanna once again emphasize how compact and portable this big sounding amp really is. At 17 inches square, that's about as tight as a one by 12 combo can get. With three configurations, we have an Astro for every occasion. It's available as a head, a 112 combo, and a 212 vertical combo. So now let's take a look at the controls on the Astroverb. The Astroverb is a one channel amp, so it's a real snap to dial in some most awesome tones. So starting on the side here, we have our input jack, plug the guitar in there, move over and adjust your preamp gain control. And then we have the reverb control. The Astroverb features an all tube driven spring reverb for a big, warm, lush tone. All the way from the slightest slap to the biggest surf sounds can be had with this reverb. Moving further along, we have bass, middle, and treble for our EQ section. And then we have our master volume, a presence control, and then a combination power switch and indicator light. Now, I also want to emphasize at this point that the Astroverb uses EL84 power tubes. So by winding the master volume all the way up to 11, and then simply using the preamp control as a volume control, this amp can emulate some of the greatest classic British sounds. The back panel of the Astroverb is about as simple as it gets. We have a power receptacle, a fuse, and speaker jacks. The Astro works equally well into four, eight, and 16 ohm speaker loads. So there you have it. So now my good friend and great guitarist, Eric Foster is going to play a surfy little garage riff to show off the Astroverb's amazing reverb. Okay, and now my good friend and guitarist extraordinaire, Evan Foster, is gonna give you some swinging country riffing. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit of the blues. Why don't you wind up that preamp a little more and give me some rock riffage? So there you have it, the Astroverb 16. 
Compact in size, big, big in sound. So plug one of these suckers into a 412 and rock it out.